O A vector is A vector, O V is B vector, and the point M divides the line segment A B internally in the ratio M1 is to M2, then prove that O M vector equals to M1 B vector plus M2 A vector divided by M1 plus M2. For this, at first let's draw let's draw the figure. Means there is a line segment A B is the line segment means O is the origin is O A and B is O B according to the question M there is a point M that divides line segment A V internally in the ratio M1 is to M2 means this much this part is M1 and this part is M2 then we need to prove that this OM vector is M1 B vector and M plus M2 A vector divided by M1 plus M2 solution here what is given first write the given OA equals to A vector OB is equals to B vector M divides AV internally in the ratio M1 is to M2 it means that that is AM divided by MB is equals to M1 is to M2 and it also shows that AB is the sum of AM plus MB or we'll proceed from here or if we add one on both side M1 upon M2 right here since adding one on both sides Or what you get uh, we solve this so the plus one is missing here it is am plus mb divided by mb is equals to m1 plus m2 divided by m2 or as I told you before am plus mb am plus mb means it's ab it's AB divided by MB means MB as it is M1 plus M2 divided by M2 or we find the value of MB MB is equals to you will multiply this one means what will be M2 divided by M1 plus M2 into AB now see uh, for these two side we can apply the vector see MB and AB they can be represented in same direction it means that we can apply the vector on both side what you will get or if you apply vector then we will get MB equals to M2 divided by M1 plus M2 into 
AV vector, let it be first condition. Now remember one thing, if the condition is BM and AB, at that time we cannot apply vector on both sides. But, see, the condition comes, what comes here, MB and AB. MB and AB means both are in same direction. At that time, we can apply vector. Now, also in triangle C, MB is obtained, then we take MB is obtained, then we take triangle OMB, means in triangle. OMB we need to find what in triangle OMB we need to find uh, the position vector of OM then MB means we apply triangle law vector addition using triangle law of vector addition what you will get using triangle of vector addition mb vector means mo vector plus ob vector see in the figure mo vector does not exist but what is there om vector means instead of mo what you can write or mo means negative of om vector plus ov vector or mb can be written as ob means ob means what see what is given ob means it's b vector means b vector at front minus om means we need to find OM vector. Okay. Now see. In relation 1 or equation 1. MB vector is this. And now what we can do is that. We can substitute. The value of MB vector from equation 1 to this. Or MB vector from first it, it is m2 by m1 plus m2 into av vector is equals to b vector minus om vector we need to find the position vector of this m means om vector what we need to prove om equals to m1 b vector plus m2 a vector by m1 plus m2 means we need to find av av or m2 divided by m1 plus m2 ab av vector means by using triangle of vector addition ab means it will be ao plus ob vector we can find this at first also equals to b vector minus om vector reason since ab vector is equals to AO vector plus OB vector using triangle of vector addition or M2 by M1 plus M2 there is not AO vector there is OA vector means it's negative of OA vector plus OB vector is equals to B vector minus OM vector or m2 divided by m1 plus m2 ob vector means b vector minus oa means a vector is equals to b vector minus om vector or what we do is that we multiply this b vector minus a vector by m2 vector we will get m2 b vector minus m2 a vector whole divided by m1 plus m2 is equals to b vector minus om vector 
as we need to find om vector bring it this side and b vector as it is this whole term will go next side and then in next step om vector equals to we take lcm m1 plus m2 will be the lcm b vector m1 plus m2 minus m2 b vector minus m2 a vector if there is minus sign we need to keep bracket or um, what we can do is that we can directly write plus sign here means now multiply m1 uh, b vector with m1 is m1 b vector plus m2 b vector minus m2 b vector minus minus plus m2 a vector and then after that just what you can see is that m2 b vector and m2 b vector it contain positive and negative sign it two is cancel therefore om vector equals to m1 b vector plus m2 a vector divided by m1 plus m2 it's proved